hey scorpios how you guys doing thank you so much for tuning back into the video this is another general love reading for you guys um if it doesn't keep in mind that this is a general love reading so if it doesn't resonate um please check your other placements okay um so i will be getting messages on how scorpio's person feels about scorpio and then I'll be getting um call I will be pulling cards on how Scorpio feels about their person in the situation. Um so let's go ahead and start shuffling. Let's go ahead and pull on the energy. Spirit, thank you so much for the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding to give Scorpio this insight and let's see what's going on with Scorpio so give me the energy around Scorpio's person how does Scorpio's person feel about Scorpio please Give me that energy, please, Garrett. Four of Wands, Two of Cups, Queen of Swords, and Judgment. And what we, at the bottom of the deck is the Five of five i'm just trying to make sure everything is in frame the five of coins so i feel like they see a future with you they they see stability with you um they see happiness with you they see a family with you um the two of cups is here that that energy is coming from the four of wands just family happiness joy celebration you guys have fun together um the two of cups is here there's definitely a connect a connection here the queen of swords is here and i feel like i feel like that's you scorpio you kind of um not waiting for the the next thing to drop or what's next or um you not necessarily you feeling like there's a um, um something negative going to happen but you you stay with kind of making up truths in your mind because you know you wear your heart on your sleeve and you always wondering um if this is too good to be true right um so you you always kind of you you put trust in your partner but they feel like you don't fully see or understand that this could be a very very positive connection for you um, so you, you're basically just, you, you have your guard up, even though, um, you really like this person, right? Um, and in your mind, you're just making sure that you do the right thing for you in the end and that you're not affected as much as you can be if you allow things, if, if you allow yourself to go far in this relationship, right? Um, yeah, and then at the bottom of the deck, we have the five of, uh, pentacles or five of coins. Um, I feel like they, um, feel like maybe you could be struggling, uh, Scorpio with money right now. Um, uh, but the five of coins represents being left out in the cold or, um, feeling, feeling left out or feeling abandoned um, but it also has an energy around um, maybe losing your job or just being short on funds um, so be careful with that okay now let's get the energy around what Scorpio feels about their person how does Scorpio feel about their person what do you feel about this connection scorpio let's get 
give me the spirit, give me the energy, please, around how Scorpio feels about uh -oh, their person. I'm not gonna take those. Give me the energy around how Scorpio feels about their person, please, spirit. So we have the Eight of Coins, the Queen of Coins, the Four of Swords, and the Two of Coins. So it's a lot of coins here. Um, so I feel like um, Scorpio is based, I, I feel like Scorpio's person has a better financial um, a stable foundation um, at this time. They work hard um, or they have worked hard for where they are um, and they're very, very comfortable um, where they are financially. So th in, that, in that essence, I feel like this could be a good match for you. Not to say, Scorpio, that um, you feel like because you you don't want to feel like you're taking advantage of somebody or using somebody right you're very very uh gracious authentic and just loving right um but your person is more a, a little bit more stable financially than you are and it's okay if you it, it um it's okay to allow them to buy dinner sometimes or um pay some bills or something like that sometimes it's okay um to um not receive a handout but just to be able to lean on your partner for some of those for some of those things um that maybe you can't do right now um the two of the two of um coins is here and i feel like um this person um sometimes struggle even though they're 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 comfortable with their finances sometimes they struggle with doing the right thing with their money so i feel like you guys complement each other right because i feel like emotionally scorpio you're you, you sometimes you can be all over the place or you know because you sometimes you make up stories in your mind about situations that are going on and you know um things that are um you don't sometimes you don't take things sorry you guys i just want to get the energy going back so i want to um light my sage thank you for waiting but sometimes scorpio you seem to um kind of make up things in your mind a little bit um like if something is going on um you'll even though it is a situation where you guys have to compromise or you have to it, it's probably more than likely not going your way you um make it into something bigger than what it is when it could just be um a compromise that needs to be had or something like that and then you you kind of take it a step further either break up or any something like that when really it just a conversation needs to be had or something like that so you kind of make up stories in your head sometimes and i feel like with this situation um your person um struggles with what they can tr what they can try to do for you or um, if they want to buy you something or if they want to take you out, they're scared to bring that to your attention. And then also this card, two of coins could also mean that they, they, um, buy things, um, outside of you that they kind of, they want to reel it in and, 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 um, do better with their money since they are dealing with someone right now that, which is you, Scorpio, that um, is working on um, your financial situation and, and being a compatible match in that area, right? I feel like that's a strain 
in you guys' situation. Um, I feel like this is you as well, Scorpio. This energy is coming up for you as well with the Eight of Coins. You are working on your situation as well. You don't like to feel inadequate or feeling like you're you're um, um, left out or feeling like you don't have it or you don't you can't express yourself the way you want to express yourself with um anyone let alone a person that you're dating or someone that you see um a future with so i feel like um this person is definitely picking up that energy from you scorpio and they're trying to figure out with the three of wands at the bottom of the deck i feel like they're trying to uh figure out um they're still even though this represents seeing the fruits of your of their labor which this person definitely has been working as well and they're um they are uh financially stable um they're trying to figure there's this is still a, uh, attached to um uh, an expansion you know trying to um still get to the next level even though you they have they have gotten together with you like they, i feel like this person pursued you so i feel like they they got you they want to be with you and they want to expand with you um and they're just trying to figure out how to do that um how to keep this connection um going and not to allow money to get in the way of that so this is really 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 good energy um Scorpio and I'm just excited for you just don't allow your extra thoughts on your own to to delegate this connection and and basically mess it up you know I I like this person for you they really like you um it's a it's a whole vibe so let's get some some um advice can we get some advice for um, Scorpio Spirit, please? Let's get some advice. Sorry, you guys. <laughs> okay. Let's get some advice for Scorpio. Please. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Scorpio, bless y'all's heart, okay? Bless y'all heart. Okay, so we have give them a chance. Try new things without feeling obligated to commit. Stay open-minded and explore new opportunities. Love tends to manifest in unexpected places. And then we have lighten up, tap into your inner child, try new things and let your youthful spirit shine. It can create memorable um, experiences and reignite romance. And then at the bottom of the deck, we have don't ignore it. Pay attention to warning signs such as physical and emotional abuse. Ignoring them can lead to long-term emotional trauma. So definitely... I feel I, I see that spirit is saying give this person a chance Scorpio lighten up um in certain situations let things flow um have fun focus on having fun making sure that the space that you guys share is a a um a delightful one a happy one um, a prosperous one. I think this connection, this, this connection can go far, um, but you have to allow yourself to um, work on your trauma that maybe you had before this. And also don't allow your self-limiting beliefs that's in your mind um, that this can't work. Well, not self-limiting beliefs, but um, make sure that you don't create th these stories that you sometimes create in your mind. Don't allow it to get in the way of your happiness, your future, your abundance. This person is in your life for a reason. Even if they're here to teach you a lesson, they're here for a reason. Allow it to play out. Allow it to 
um, um, manifest in your life and make sure that you let it um, unfold the way it's supposed to. Okay, Scorpio? Um, that's all I have for you today. I thank you for tuning in to my channel, coming to check me out, hanging out with your girl. Please, if you if, if this video resonated with you in some some kind of way, please like the video. Um, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And um, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.